It's one part of space travel that hasn't changed much for about four decades. The spacesuit is getting an upgrade. The Polaris Dawn crew, set to launch Tuesday out of Florida, will be wearing and testing a brand new extravehicular activity suit, or EVA suit, one designed by SpaceX for much more than fashion. SpaceX does not take this lightly. Uh, they know they need EVA capability, the knowledge of the operations and the suit in order to fulfill their, their long-term dream of, um, of potentially populating another planet someday. The Polaris Dawn crew is set to go about 1,400 kilometers out from Earth, about three times further than the International Space Station. At that distance, there are bigger challenges, there's more radiation and more micrometeorites. And they're going to be farther than, than pretty much any human, uh, with the exception, of course, of the um, um, Apollo missions uh, to the moon. The mission will also include a spacewalk done in a new way. There's no airlock, so the entire capsule will be depressurized. Two astronauts will take turns going out, but in fact, all four will be exposed to the vacuum of space. The EVA is definitely the, the spacewalk is definitely the, the, the riskiest of, of all the things that they're doing. EV-1 is transitioning for egress. Now, another big difference with this mission is the financing. It was funded by SpaceX and one of the men on board. Billionaire entrepreneur Jared Isaacman is the mission commander. Can you give sort of a ballpark estimate of how much money you've invested into this program so far? Not a chance. Good question. <laughs> one of the benefits of writing checks for the mission is that Isaacman got to handpick the crew. Mike Armstrong, Global News, Washington.